Picture this, 1,000 people crammed into a two-car garage. This is the amount of space a child growing up in a poor neighborhood of Los Angeles can ever hope to have. In fact, low-income communities of color have the least amount of green space. Less than one square foot per person, not even enough space to stand in. My name is Alina Bokde. I am the Executive Director of the Los Angeles Neighborhood Land Trust. With public and private funds, we buy or lease small pockets of land in underserved, dense areas and transform them into parks and gardens. These spaces provide places for kids to play, for the community to socialize and find respite in a concrete jungle. Our gardens also enable local families to grow their own fruits and vegetables. A child living within a mile of a park will be 500% more likely to have a healthy weight. Access to green space can reduce stress levels by as much as one third. Soon, we will be celebrating the opening of a new park south of Watts. When the Land Trust first began working with the community, the blighted property was next to what locals called Death Alley, where the pastor's own brother had been murdered. Crime and death transformed into faith and hope, the name selected by this community to describe what this new nature park will mean to them, Faith and Hope Park. We are different than public agencies. We create community stewards. With the community, we find sites and together design and build these new green spaces. We then train community stewards to maintain these sites ongoing. As an urban land trust, we protect the sites forever. Even in 100 years, they cannot be built over. To date, we've completed nine parks and gardens. Now, 14 new projects are planned, equivalent to nine green football fields, benefiting over 70,000 residents. Current funding is only for land and construction. We need $150,000 to create and implement a comprehensive leadership program for 200 community volunteers for, to steward these new parks. Join us on a project tour. Come visit these small oases in our city. Help us build vibrant communities sustained with our parks and gardens. Thank you.